Welcome back to my channel guys and today before we get started I just wanted to do a quick PSA so someone by the name of Cyber Galactic Nova has notified us that alongside the four storms event usually and it was seen in both the Chinese server and the Japan server the lucky draw for the lucky cat is quote-unquote resetting and the reason why it's in quote unquote is because it's not the actual long-term lucky cat event that is resetting it's like if you haven't finished it it doesn't matter it won't affect it at all it's kind of like another short-term event tab or just like another tab in general that has three reset tiers so that's 1888 3188 and 6188 so the tip here is that we should wait a few days into the event before you decide to spend all your diamonds on it because a lot of people found out that this reset happens like a few days after the event. So when everybody first spent all their diamonds on the first three days, they didn't have enough diamonds to do the reset. So that's my tip to you guys today. And thank you so much to Cyber Galactic Nova for letting us know because that's some very important information, especially for those of us who actually really need those extra diamonds. And one more thing before I get started. Um, I'm going to be posting timestamps. I don't know if you guys noticed in the past few videos already, but there's timestamps in the actual video themselves so when you scroll through the video you can actually see the different names but yeah if you want to scan through the video like that you can do this now and without further ado let's get started so our very very first suit over here is shining youth it is a love nikki debut suit and it's going to cost about 50 vip so that would be equivalent to less than 199 us dollars or 279 Canadian dollars without tax. So you know what, for 50 VIP, it's not that bad, And but I think we should go on to the next tier. So the next tier is the virtual violinist suit and she is going to cost 810 VIP. So the best way to get to 810 VIP is to get a diamond card in the next tier above. So that would be around 499 plus 999 US dollars or it's going to be $6.99 plus $13.99 Canadian dollars. And why don't we look at the beautiful, beautiful suit over here. Um, this is her in her full glory. If you look carefully, she has a stage. She has weird bold legs, which I thought were hilarious because she's using a bow and everything. <laughs> and then she has an amazing, beautiful big dress. But the best part of all are those kind of holographic wings in the back. And her violin looks really good. And somebody in the previous comments have mentioned that her violin actually looks proportional to her body. So yay, we have that going for us. And to zoom in closer, the violin actually looks dope. Her makeup is gorgeous, stunning. Like this is definitely something I would want. Overall, I'm not really much of a fan of her dress and everything, but alongside her stage, the wings and everything else, I think she's actually a pretty worth it suit to get. And then next we have Witch's Whale. Um, it's going to be about 2,300 VIP and it's going to be somewhere between 1999 to 4999 US dollars and then 2799 to 6999 Canadian dollars because the problem is is that it's such a weird number like I don't know how to calculate it obviously there probably is a way but it's too early in the morning for me to do math so it's going to be around this price range and she is a Korean debut suit I actually was able to find the only picture of her from the Korean event and I didn't even know that there was a Korean server to begin with if we go to her actual pose over here it's okay like I don't know why she's holding a sword and everything but if the whole point of this was the mirrors in the back then wow the mirrors are amazing it's such a beautiful background item and I have to say I really adore her hair because it's like a long purple wavy hair as for the mask itself eh, and from what I can see from her makeup eh, and like those are those tassels earrings or are they part of the mask? Okay, so they're part of the mask, they're not earrings, so that's why they look so odd. But okay, let's go back to the mirrors. The mirrors just blow me away. It's like that eternal tree that we see from the uh, Steps of Sorrow event. And yeah, I could see this totally being used in the Star Recorder. It's so beautiful. Okay, wow, beautiful. And then next we have Divine Deer. So this is a 3,910 VIP recharge. Again, a very confusing amount that like it's hard to not overshoot. I mean, you could do the 49.99 tier plus the 880 VIP tier, but like whatever, you can do the calculation yourself. It's going to cost around 49.99 to 99.99, closer to the lower end for US dollars. And for the Canadian dollars, it's going to be 69.99 <laughs> and 139.99 Canadian dollars, closer to the lower end. 
So this has a special pose, dynamic special effects, and a new background. And all I can say is that this suit is hella ethereal and I love it a lot. She is so jam-packed with a lot of different items and here she is in her full glory as well. She's holding like a spirit deer, definitely love it. And even in her unposed version, she looks so like elegant beautiful and she has like this moon halo which is very neat and overall I think that her makeup is very cute her hair is very cute like all of this is definitely my aesthetic because it's so soft and beautiful and like I want it in my wardrobe and moving on to the last 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 tier we have the 6300 VIP tier. So this one is a tier that makes sense. Like I kind of just want to skip all the tiers before it and just buy the 6300 diamond tier because it just makes like it makes the math easier and you get all the suits beforehand. But doing that means that you have to pay 99.99 US dollars or 139.99 Canadian dollars without tax. And with tax for Canadians, it's probably going to be about 150 something dollars. So like what? 150 something dollars for like pixels? I don't know. Probably will get it, but I'm very hesitant to because your girl's tight on money this month. But yeah. Let's look at this suit. So this suit is gorgeous. Like ever since I saw it in the Japan server, I'm like, oh my god, I need it, I need it, I need it. The carousel snow globe thing going on. Like I want her, I want her. She's like the pastel princess that I've always, always wanted. But anyways, there is a special feature to her alongside her adorable Lolita type makeup. She has adorable hair, but the most adorable part of this outfit excluding the rabbit is the fact that this is a music box so if you actually clicked on it and you completed the entire outfit you can unlock the special music box effect and i am so tempted in getting her so let me know what your thoughts are in the comments below are you going to spend on it are you going to just skip it and close your eyes because money is tight and girl i feel you guys um, are you going to go charge up to one of the tiers? Are you disappointed that something didn't come? I would love to hear all your thoughts in the comments below. So yeah, if you like this type of content, remember to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will catch you all later. Bye!